guys, I just want to do a quick update here. This is the first board that I uh, did the printer method with, and it was my uh, uh, HP over there in the shop, and I think it's running out of toner or something. So, and this was uh, most successfully done with uh, just plain uh, pages out of a new uh, magazine. It's got to be slick paper. And then I ran it through my uh, my uh, Amazon Basic um, laminator, and that was the first result. Not well. This is the second result. That what I found was that you don't want any tape. I uh, have to tape the pattern on and it's best to fold it around the board I found and tape it on the back side. Uh, if you're doing a double side board that'd be a little bit harder but um, you can see some of the traces pulled up on that. I'm going to try to actually uh, um, repair that with a, uh, I believe a sharpie will just work. Uh, we'll have to, I'm going to etch that one as well. Um, and then this is my last result. And this was from a page that I set on the garbage can bringing it out here. And it got all wet. And uh, so I let it dry overnight. And uh, then uh, it looks like uh, all the traces transferred over. I'm going to etch this one as, and uh, touch up the other one. And then we'll go ahead and put it in some etching. Okay, guys got the two PC boards and ferrochloride I picked this up at my local electronics store one of the only ones in Anchorage Alaska so uh, it's probably way easier to get it shipped shipping is always an issue to Alaska so uh, pick some of that up and this is a pro glass container it's got a locking lid Good seal. Told my wife she won't ever see it again. Okay. So I'm just going to put a bottom worth in. That much. That was only maybe a tenth of that bottle. Lid on tight. Put this up on Okay, guys. Got a minute timer. Basically, turn the dial. I'm going to use that to time the, the boards, so I'm going I'm to set it to five minutes. I'm going to drop in, I'm going to do this board first. guys I'm gonna go ahead and agitate this every once in a while and this isn't super dangerous it's not a real super strong acid but you wouldn't want to get it on your clothes Okay, so you see there's still a lot of copper. I'm going to dip it back down in. I'm going to set up for another five. I'm going to agitate the board a little bit. That's a projection. No, it's the units shipping next month based on a real-time analytics model. 
You're not going to round that up. You don't round up facts. Powerful elements.